I have a few things plugged into the maker bit micro bit here I've got a couple motors this is the motor controller place to plug in one is plugged into motor a technical actually motor a1 and another is plugged into motor B motor B1 uh, you can put four one direction motors on here but only one a and one B can be running at one time uh, it's a voltage and a controller uh, limitation so you gotta pay attention to how many motors you can actually run at once how I'm gonna run them is I'm gonna make them turn on and off by buttons I've plugged one button into analog zero and I plugged one button into analog one again buttons are just two prongs there's two pins there for the analog for one uh, a0 through a4 is in this bit here I could have plugged a0 and a1 up here also uh, it's a three prong setup for quick connection to the things like the need three prongs that need power and ground and signal uh, like a servo so I could have plugged one into the ground and one into the signal and ignore the power track there I also have an LED strip plugged in a new pixel strip plugged into pin 16 um, like an indicator light uh, you're gonna want to know when things are on or when things are running um, sometimes you can't see can't hear the motor running can't hear it more often than not seeing it uh, so that's what the lights would be for so here we go we turn it on I've got it set that's supposed to be yellow I've got it set for yellow on the start and when I press a button um, the motor should turn on I'm gonna hold this one up because I put a wheel on it you see it went green because that motor is running uh, code has that motor stopped did an alternate kind of thing and then I turn this motor off with that button press you turn that motor on again we just go back and forth motor on motor off you just kind of work out the logic you want you know what do you need running one motor both motors so you could see that there's some there's enough plugged in here that you need an expansion board because you couldn't plug this all straight into the micro bit um, especially because motors need some kind of motor controller and then I added you know two switches I added um, some lights you'd really want you know if I had two motors running I'd want four buttons and two sets of lights uh, an on off for both motor and uh, indicator lights for both motors and there we go